Jeez. Happy day, I'm good. <laughs> and welcome to our comedy heaven. I don't think you'll survive. I think you should try your best though, not to laugh. I know for me, if, if I tried not to laugh, I would corpse. So I'm just gonna like go with the flow and see what happens. Oh, senor, it's my first time with a blind man. Oh, well, you'll like it. Dear God, my husband is home, hiding under the bed. <laughs> she goes up, she's like, honey, you're home early. <laughs> oh, he's just laying in the middle of her floor. That's kind of funny, right? Come on. I thought it was all right. All right, so this guy's texting his landlord. He's trying to move in. Landlord, it's clear in the lease. No pets are allowed in the apartment. Sorry. <laughs> and he sends a picture of his frog. Doesn't say anything else. And the landlord's like, all right, I'll make an exception because he looks very polite. He does look polite. Look at his little frog hands. He's just sitting, he's sitting there like twink sits, you know? Like he just, he looks like a good boy. Have you ever seen a frog that looks like a good boy? I'd let him live there too. He does look quite polite. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't get why this is on there. <laughs> I don't get why this is on here. It's a Walmart ad that's like, Adam can't wait to eat this succulent and sweet corn. It's only four for one dollar and there's just Adam there. Why, okay, why is he holding the corn like this? He can't wait. He can't wait to sink his little teeth into this little corn. This is the face that you make when you're just like, oh man, I am not getting paid enough for this. Four for one. How did this make it on there? Is there like a meme in this meme that I'm missing? This is intense. This guy's girlfriend is really, really mad at him. She's like, where are you? And he's like, I messed up. How? How did you mess up? I went to India, not Indiana. Just tell me you don't love me. Tell me that you want to leave me instead of making up these lies. And then he sends it. a selfie of himself like really confused in India with a bunch of cows behind him. I mean, how do you argue that? He's telling the truth. But wouldn't he, wouldn't have he noticed that like his flight was $2,000 instead of like $500? You know how sometimes like fast food restaurants, they do like, they do partnerships with like various Disney things. Like sometimes you get Mickey Mouse and Minnie Mouse in your Happy Meal. Well, this is unofficial. In Domino's Pizza Zimbabwe, they're like, our new Shrek play area is ready for the children, including friends like Cat in Shoes, Biscuit Guy, and Unpleasant Mule. They just like butchered these Shrek characters' faces so they could like unofficially put them there. I feel like they would still get sued though. But at the same time, like, I feel like Disney would feel kind of bad. Please don't do this. I seriously can't live without you. I didn't cheat on you. <laughs> stonks. I didn't mean to send that. <laughs> oh, okay. The stonks meme was like kind of getting old for me, but like this is, this is really good. <laughs> this could be one of those things that like actually saved the relationship, you know? Like, you know, when you're like fighting so hard and then one of you makes the other one laugh and then it makes it okay. Unless this girl really messed up. I feel like it's a, a savior. This one's actually perfect. This is from Obamani boy Kairul. He says, if sexy benig crime, then I am arrest. <laughs> oh, that pose. It's the kind of pose that I would have done in high school, like before I knew how to look good in a picture. Like, you know how like girls in like grad pictures, they do like the whole like this thing. I'd say this is the male equivalent. Like he's like, I got swagger. Look at, look at that curve in my spine. He is arrest. How often would you like to get updates about beef stroganoff? You can choose daily, weekly, a few times a month, I mean, it's beef stroganoff. I don't think you need to be reminded that much. Maybe a few times a year, or only if something big happens. What kind of big thing would happen in the world of beef stroganoff? This homeless guy found my mom's phone and keeps FaceTiming me, telling me he's my new dad. <laughs> if this guy found my mom's phone and just kept FaceTiming me like, hey, I'm your new dad, I would just accept him. I'd accept him into the family. I mean, he's really putting the work in. He's really putting the FaceTime in. Pathetic frog birthday cake from supermarket leaves parents mortified. It was a disgrace, they say. It's just a happy face. And what is this, a set of balls? Imagine paying for this. I love sexist memes with typos. 80% of boys have girlfriends. Rest 20% are having a brain. I would love to uh, are have a brain. Some of these are so bad. How did they get in here? You know when you sign up for something and then you get like the message confirming your appointment? And that's like, from Behavioral Health Education Services, Justin has an appointment with Dr. Marshall. On this date, reply to confirm date and time. This guy thought it was a computer, so he was just like, pee pee poo poo. Justin, this is not an automated message. Should we consider this a confirmation for said date and time? I'd be so embarrassed. I don't even like risk it. I don't even risk replying to those messages because what if it's a guy? You never know. <laughs> this grandma. I've lost eight pounds since July. <laughs> she uploads this picture of herself with like these this beautiful filter on the beach. 
<laughs> oh my god, that is so- this is so cute and so funny and like something that only- I feel like only a grandma could do and it has to be someone who seriously does it for it to have the punch that it has. It's so good. Toothbrush taped to the ceiling! There it is! The comments like, how'd you get the toothbrush up there? Tape! I mean, it is- it, it's- it is what it says it is. I don't know why he filmed it for an hour. Toothbrush. Quality content. I mean, it's better what I've been making. Aww. Daniel Pinafiel is in a- is in a relationship with Nicole Prado. It's him with Photoshop. That is so sad. This guy should work for the CIA. <laughs> this guy's Facebook post, he's like, my phone, my photos. Buy your own phone, and he just blurs everybody else's faces out. This guy's a legend. Wow, that is- that is bitter. But you know what? It's his phone, his choice. Oh, what would you do if we accidentally kissed? What would you do? What waff you do if we accidental kiss? What would you do if this happened? What would you- STOP IT! God, stop! The person hasn't replied, leave them alone! Oh, I'm so glad I've never known somebody like that. Like, stop, he's already dead. <laughs> New car for stupid hoe wife. Hashtag car. Hashtag I hate my wife. He's, he's scary. <laughs> hey, you gonna buy a car for my hoe? Thank you. Pie eating contest? Nah, son. Free pie. This guy knows what he's doing. You might as well just like join an eating contest and just like- But what if they like disqualify you and like kick you out early? All I know is that this guy's got the right idea. He's so adorable. He has your eyes. And deaf your smile. <laughs> there, he, there he is. He's a cutie. Well, only six to eight weeks left. Until uh, what? I don't know. <laughs> Thanks for the announcement. Thanks for letting us all know. Honest question. What's the hardest thing you've ever had to say to somebody? Someone responds, I had to tell my sister that her dad had killed himself. The next guy says, Worcestershire. 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 What is that steak sauce called? Worcestershire. -shire -shire. I think he wins. And he got more upvotes. Yikes. Oh. Do you remember back in the day when you could put like a little pop-up card on your videos? <laughs> this video is like to Vanessa. And then he added a card after the fact that it's like, Vanessa betrayed me. This, this video is no longer for her. Why not just take the video down? He must be so proud that he made this video. <laughs> he just kept it up and was like, yeah, he, she's a, she's a hoe. <laughs> this guy's basement flooded. He takes this selfie <laughs> with the water up to here and is like, my basement got no business looking like this. <laughs> He's not impressed. Ooh, 2001 Ford Mustang for sale. GT Premium Convertible 2D. $900? That's kind of cheap. I wonder why. Oh, there's tree damage. <laughs> there's an actual whole tree through this car. Tree damage. I mean, still, pretty good deal. Anyone lose a dog in Uniondale? White, male, puppy? Please contact me. Trying to find his owners. Thanks. See, there he is. You gotta hold it. Like, you gotta hold him to get a better picture of his face, this person's friend says. He won't stay still. This is the best I can do. That's so scary. Anyone lose this guy? If you lost this guy, do you want to come pick him up? I certainly don't. Okay, so these two guys walk up to each other here. Hey, bro. Hey, what's up, man? He takes this thing and just <laughs> bonks him on the head. Why is that funny? What's wrong with me? <laughs> this cow is biting this girl's head and it's like, who's the burger now? Hand burger. <laughs> I mean, the cow's getting its revenge. Can't really complain. Her poor face. She looks like she's actually in pain. They have good food here. Egg spinach sandwich. How is your mom? Thanks for asking. She passed away at 9.41 this- Oh. Oh, so she's eating at the hospital. They have good food here. Okay, thanks for- Thanks for the update. Thanks for the important update. A lot of this humor is like really dark. Your teen comes home and you smell Mary Jane. Now what? <laughs> this calls for air guitar. <laughs> this is obviously a different ad, but like the placement is so good. <laughs> In 20 years.com, this kid will look like this. In 20 years. Does that does that actually exist? Okay, let's it's there's a security check. Let's just go ahead and not do that. What's the difference between the alligator and the crocodile? The difference is in the shape of their jaws. Alligators eat babies in an A shape, and crocodiles eat babies in a C shape. Now you'll never forget. Ugh, two-year-olds nowadays, and me at two years old. Ugh, wrong generation, huh? These these dang Gen Zs, they're two. They grow up so fast. I bet she was like 20 and she just like hid this arrow. She's like, I'm two. Check me out. I climb mountains and I fast. That's why I look like this. Well, I think that's enough comedy heaven for me for one day. Did you guys find it to be heaven? I know I said at the beginning that I didn't know if you were gonna survive, but like it got kind of weird. 
Let me know if you guys thought it was entertaining. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you'd ever like to see me again, make sure you hit push notifications, and I will see you on the next one. Bye!